Hi, my name is Jamie Salazar. I'm the author of Legion of the Lost. Thanks for having a look at my book. Of course, it's out now, the revised edition, 2016. And uh, I think you'll enjoy the changes upon that. I don't know if you read the, the previous version or whether you're just buying the new one. Uh, I think it's the new release and publicity about it. Uh, but there are some subtle changes to the new edition versus the uh, original one, which was released in 2005. I think most readers will find that the the Bynes edition is a bit cleaner. There were some typographical errors that were in the original one uh, that are not in the new one. I've cleaned it, cleaned it up pretty well. And I've added a few things that I thought were, were, were left out in the original draft. Uh, of course, a lot of these things kind of get left out in the, shall we say, cutting room floor. So I added a lot of that back in there. Uh, nevertheless, it's still the same size book. Uh, I didn't pad it at all in any way. I, I give it a little bit more of a personal spin to it. I, 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 think, I think I get the flavor of that. Uh, give it a little more justice um, had I had the chance to do my due diligence on the first time around. So anyway, I really hope you enjoyed the new book. Um, and if you're not familiar with the book at all, if you're just curious about the subject matter, I think you'll enjoy it because, because it, in, in a brief summary, it's really uh, the book about a young man, an idealist, idealistic young man who's on a journey, who's, who's searching for answers in life. And he ends up in the French Foreign Legion. And of course, he does find all the answers. He finds himself. He finds God. He finds a completely new dimension that he hadn't seen before. He also finds things, obviously, that don't work out for him. He realizes that the situation is perhaps not to his taste, and that maybe there's other ways to sort of go about finding enlightenment, uh, rites of passage, and manhood. So anyway, it's a really interesting tale for people who sort of enjoy the uh, type of biography of people who are doing things that are a bit odd and, and different and difficult. Or for the real traditional military buff who wants to know what it's really like in the French Revolution. And I can tell you, the French Revolution today, 2016, is probably not that different than it was in 1999 when I was in it. So in either case, thank you for coming here. And thank you for visiting my author's page. I really hope you enjoy the book. Uh, make some comments. Uh, I know I've already gotten quite a bit of comments throughout the years. I'm sure we'll get a few more, so I'm happy to engage with you and uh, discuss the merits of my latest work.